What's happening? Anthony back with probably what will be the last video of 2022. Probably. Uh, only a couple days left. I'm recording this on actually a Friday morning before I go to work. I uh, just wanted to take a quick minute, maybe maybe 20 minutes, not a quick minute, to, uh, to show you all some tapes. Um, I love tapes. If you watch this channel, you'll know that I, uh, I'm crazy about cassette tapes. Um, uh, just, I don't know what it is about them. It just seems like it's the epitome of underground to me, you know, to get the underground tapes, the demos and the EPs. I love this stuff. Love death metal tapes. And uh, I pulled 22 tapes out for 2022. And these are all EPs and demos. Probably the majority of them are EPs and uh, a handful of demos. But uh, these are the EPs and demos that I have purchased this year. Well, 22 of them at any rate that I want to share with you guys. Uh, some of these will be uh, familiar to you. Some of them may not be. If they're not, I would suggest that you go check these out if you're into death metal at all. I mean, these are some of the uh, up-and-comers. These are some that um, maybe you hadn't heard of, but all are worthy of your consideration. So without further ado, uh, in the background, we're going to be listening to Ophis. Uh, killer stuff. I won't turn it up real loud. My wife's still asleep and she'll come in here with a pistol and probably sh shoot me on camera. Maybe not. Probably just cuss real bad. All right, first off, without further ado, uh, check this out. Putridarium. Um, this was their, uh, they actually had two demos out this year. This was their earliest one out in May. I've already shown it earlier in the year. Out on Head Split. Uh, if Putridarium is a new uh, band to you, this is German death metal. You get three tracks on this demo. Uh, like I say, it was out on Head Split. Just quality, quality, quality stuff. And the uh, most recent one actually just came out this month. This is. Uh, Dissemination 2022 demo came on this killer blue shell. You get four tracks on this one. This one's out on head split as well. There, the guys there. Uh, that art is actually by Lucas Court. J card folds out like so. Uh, Putridarium had a demo last year and two demos this year so hopefully fingers crossed we'll get a full length from these guys in 2023 hopefully moving to the uk alucard i think you say tapis teepees uh, i'm not sure this one came out on stump grinder records i say the uk uh, actually has brendan dean doing the vocals there's the cassette, Josh Allen, uh, uh, let's see, Matt Parker on here, you get three tracks, a um, little over nine minutes of music, superb, superb. Next one up, and these are in no particular order, I just pulled them off the shelf. Uh, I keep a list of stuff that I buy, on what format it's on, and whether it's an EP or a cassette, I mean an EP or a full length demo, split, comp, whatever, and where I got it from so that I can put it on my discards and I just simply went through and picked 22 out. Uh, this one is Caustic Phlegm, so why I'm telling you that is this is not, um, this is not a thorough list by no means if, if you don't see your release on here or a release that you thought should be on here it doesn't mean that i don't like it i didn't pull it out or i i just simply don't have it uh case in point evan i don't have uh, the new chest cr chest crush but it's not because i don't want it it's just because i don't have it uh of course like i said 
uh, Putrefying Flesh is the name of this demo. Uh, this is out on uh, the incest label or what came to be known as Corp Gristle, Corpse Gristle. Of course, this is Evan. Uh, he does guitars, vocals, bass, drum programming, uh, all that stuff. You get three tracks on here, uh, a little over 13 minutes of music. Superb, Evan, superb. I'm going to get you new release man it's just uh just hadn't surfaced yet i don't guess uh here's one that i believe that caligari actually sent me this is grotesqueries um and the name of this one is haunted mausoleum this is an ep as i said it came out on uh caligari boston massachusetts death metal you get three tracks on uh this one There is the J card. Um, the the man behind this actually plays the drums, writes the uh, music, and does the uh, lyrics on here. And then he brings in guest guitarist, guest vocalist, and a guest bassist to make this all happen. And um, it is superb, grotesqueries, death metal out of Boston, Massachusetts. Um, moving right along, uh, Ritual Fog, this one's out on Corpse Gristle as well, the name of this release is Visions of Blasphemy, it's actually an EP, uh, Ritual Fog is a three piece out of Memphis, Tennessee, you get three tracks on this bad boy, and it is a banger 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 ritual fog out of memphis 10 three six mafia uh also out of tennessee uh piss rot the name of this one is piss vile and gunk uh ep out on corpse gristle as well kingsport tennessee three piece some young guys i mean really young guys you get five tracks on this one. Um, how cool is that? Well, it didn't fall all the way to the floor, but it went close to it. Piss Rock, Kingsport, Tennessee. Uh, moving right along, Trench Foot. And the name of this one is Moral Obscenity. EP out on Stump Grinder Records. Uh, of course, this is Joe Bradley out of England. One man show right here, baby. One man show. You get three tracks on this one. There's Big Joe right there. Super cool stuff. Trench foot. Been doing some stuff that I absolutely love. Staying with the UK. This is... Go ahead and take it out. Slime Lord, Insurmountable Peril EP. Uh, this one came out on Dry Cough. Uh, England Five Piece, you get two tracks on this one. This is their third EP so far, and still no full length. So hopefully 2023 will be the year for the full length release from Slime Lord. Okay, Tar. I don't think you'll find these guys on Metal Archives, but you will find them at Frozen Screams Imprint. That's where I picked mine up. Uh, this is an EP. Uh, five tracks on this one. Brutal death metal. Uh, heavy, almost slammy at times. You get 18 minutes of music. There's the inside of the J card. There's the guys from Rhode Island here in the United States. Great stuff, great stuff. I'm not a slam man. This is not slam, but it approaches slam. It's got those slammy uh, parts in it, but uh, superb. If you haven't heard of Tar, check these guys out. And uh, just as a side note, Frozen Screams Imprint always does a great job. They ship their cassettes in those little individual boxes. Man, it's just well done, well done professional in every way. 
here's one that's got a bunch of attention throughout the year for good reason. This is Tomb Sentinel with Perpetual Vice EP out on Life After Death. You know, if it's got Eric Stamp on it, it's good stuff. Death Metal uh, with that hardcore tinge from Columbus, Ohio. You get four tracks on this one. Uh, this features uh, Devin Swank. Uh, you may recognize that name. Uh, and that young man from Sanguish Sugarbog. Vocalist, frontman, maniac, tomb sentinel, super stuff if you haven't stuck that in your ear yet, it's about time. R.I.P. Moving on to Germany, still resting EP out on Life After Death. Every time I hear that right there, I think about enchantment, listen to that riff. Isn't that something? R.I.P. Still resting. I forgot where I was at. Life After Death. Second um, EP from these, this German death metal uh, group. Uh, I absolutely love these guys. Uh, hopefully, this will 2023 will be the year of the full length uh, death metal wizards from Germany. Spent three years over there myself. Beautiful country, beautiful people, great place to be, or at least it was then. Um, here's one, Chasm Dweller. The name of this one is Festering in Oral Trauma EP. Uh, this one was independently, independently released. Uh, Death Doom from Toronto, Canada. Uh, members of Anguish and also in Malgoth. You get four tracks on this one, about 25 and a half minutes of music. Uh, all the tunes are at least six minutes long. Great stuff if you haven't checked out Chasm Dweller. Well worth your time. Oh, here you go, Death dissecting glorification demo this one is out on necrolatry records uh, Malaysian death metal uh, these guys have eight demos man eight demos we need a full length man a full length come on with it Malaysian death metal super stuff I just showed these guys um, a few weeks back uh, well, I can't see that far. I think it was a uh, split with Lavatory, another death metal band from Malaysia. Uh, the Malaysian scene is live and well thanks to guys like Repudeth. If you haven't heard from these guys, check it out. This is a demo out on Necrolatry Records. I think I'm saying that right. I always have trouble with that word, Necrolatry. Check this out. Colossomy bag. Ooh, nasty self-titled EP out on Stump Grinder Records, Gilbert, Arizona, death metal band, there is inside the J card, there's the outside, four tracks, a little over 14 minutes of music, super stuff, um, I had thought that I had heard somewhere that they were going to have a split with um, Mangle, but um, Mangle's another band that you need to check out. But uh, I haven't seen it either. It slid by me or it hadn't come to fruition yet, but this is good stuff there. Colossomy Bag, Gilbert, Arizona's own death metal band. Uh, here you go, Spanish death metal, Leprophiliac, Slime Bath EP. This one is out on RFL Records. Uh, RFL stands for Rescue from Life out of Texas. I think this is the first uh, release that I have from RFL. That's, that's almost criminal. Uh, super heavy stuff. Like I say, this is a death metal d duo from Spain. 
you haven't heard of leprophiliac today is your lucky day baby friday the last friday in 2022 you were introduced to leprophiliac don't forget it there is cryptum vile emergence ep out on caligari uh cryptum death metal from juliet illinois you get four tracks on this one from this five piece this smoky shell is so cool uh, almost 16 minutes of music killer stuff absolutely killer stuff there's the guys standing there look like they're in a police lineup been there done that nah not really they didn't even have to put me in a lineup they knew they had their man just kidding cryptum vile emergence uh joliet right there in the backyard of Ken the Death Metal Crypt. Uh, there you go, Extinguished Vomitous Manifestations Demo. Um, check out this lime green cassette here out on Caligari. Finish Death Metal. Let me pull this thing out here where you can see that. That art. The name of this one is Vomitous Manifestations. Four tracks of filthy horrible disgusting death metal sound like mark g with a c don't i staying in finland sepulchral curse uh the name of this one is the deathbed sessions ep this is out on transylvania recordings transylvania tapes whatever you want to call it you know who i'm talking about uh finnish blackened death metal uh, from this five piece you get four tracks on this one a uh, little over 24 minutes of music super stuff if you're not familiar with these guys and you like your death metal with that blackened edge to it um, sepulchral curse is the band for you three moss trace moss Let's see here. Malignant. And the name of this one is Reign of Decrepitude. Comes on this green shell. This is an EP out on Transylvania. Uh, death metal from Los Angeles, California. Uh, there's the lads right there. You see it's a five piece. Uh, actually, uh, on this one, this was actually a comp. I'm sorry I broke my my opening statements, but uh, tracks one through three are the new um, EP, and then they threw in. So this is actually two EPs. So uh, I'm technically still correct in my statement, but uh, then there's the uh, the new stuff right there. Well, I tell you what, I think. Yeah, on, on the cassette version, you just get the three new uh, uh, things on the EP. I think it's been a long time since I listened to this. Yeah, that's right. But if you get the CD version, I'm, I'm babbling now. I'm not sure. Three tracks, new stuff. EP from Malignant out of LA, out on Transylvania tapes. Disregard all that other stuff. Five o'clock in the morning, man. Dodskbad. Man, what are we listening to in the background? McGuire. Hold on, boys. Hold on. Hold on. It's too early in the morning for that. Let's see. What y'all want to hear? Hmm. Sivers. Back to where I was at. Dodskbad. Chronic Volume 2 out on Caligari. Uh, check that shell out. It's kind of hard to see that. Uh, Norwegian Death Metal. They actually had a Chronic uh, number one, and you can get one and two on a CD that uh, Caligari released as well. Four tracks, about 24 and a half minutes of music. 
uh, on this one. Uh, if you're not familiar with these guys, three-piece Norwegian death metal band. Guys are very active in the scene over there, active in a bunch of other bands. Um, great stuff, great stuff. Need I say more? Last but not least, like I said, these were in no particular order. Just pulled them out. Don't have enough brains to put them in alphabetical order and too lazy to look them up to put them in chronological order at the time they came out. So here you go. Last but not least, Pale Gaze out on Stump Grinder Records. Death Metal from Connecticut, Connecticut, Connecticut. When I was in school, none of us could spell it, so the teacher finally told us to write connect, I cut, and that's the way we learned to spell Connecticut. Connecticut, <laughs> Connecticut, I can't even say it now. See the old stump grinder chainsaw there with the pale gaze uh, logo. Uh, all kidding aside, killer stuff. Uh, this guy is so talented. This is Peter Blanchett, I think is how you say his name. Uh, he does it all. You may recognize that name from Mutilation Barbecue. He plays guitar with them as well. Super stuff, pale gaze butchered into cosmic hell out on stump grinder records and that's it 22 cassettes for 2022 eps and demos that you need to check out if you haven't man we appreciate y'all 2022 just flew by man we're looking forward to 2023 so much stuff happening in the vinyl community so much stuff uh, happening in the underground music world and uh, it's just hard to keep up if you didn't see your favorite EP or demo on cassette in this video, it doesn't mean that it's not my favorite as well. It just means that I may not have pulled it out or probably more likely I don't own it. So uh, do the best we can. I know there's a bunch of other EPs and demos out this year that are super stuff. I know there's Mournful Congregation, there's Worm. Um, this, that one, another one. I've showed most of those on vinyl updates or CD updates or cassette updates before. So um, these are cassettes, baby. 22 of them for 2022. We appreciate y'all, all our subs, everybody who watches, and especially when you take time to comment. Um, hope my hair wasn't messed up in this video. Check out the shirt, man. Y'all be good. I hope 2023 is the best year yet for you and your family. Cheers, brother, sisters.